pressure. Start. Okay, Don Giovanni breaks into the Comendatori's house. Donna Anna says, no, 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 you don't. Don Giovanni is assaulting Donna Anna in her room and she tries to flee away from him and then her father comes and he is trying to save her and Don Giovanni ends up killing him. Uh, Leporello's been waiting downstairs in the cold and the rain. He's tired. Leporello is outside waiting for his master. He's telling us about all the women that he be having all over the land. The next thing you know, Don G, he runs outside. He's followed by Anna and then they get into a little squabble. Don Giovanni and Leporello leave and then he smells <laughs> Donald Elvira. She like meets up with Don Giovanni and she's like really pissed and also really heartbroken. So it's like, we feel real bad for this woman. They're like, wait a minute, we know her. So he tries to get with her again, not realizing that it's her. Then he realizes Don Elvira who's chasing after him. So Don Giovanni runs away. Leporello tells her that he's a womanizer and they end up at a wedding at a mall somewhere. And there's this girl um, named Serlina, Serlinetta, same thing. And then we go to this like random wedding. And then of course, Don Giovanni comes in and he sees the bride and he's like, she's cute. And then he goes and flirts with her and her fiance, husband, Masato is mad. And so- and Don G's like, well, why don't we just have the party at my house? But at the same time, I'm gonna try and woo this new bride over here. He tries to seduce Zerlina. She's actually kind of interested. Um, until it turns out that he's really a bad guy. Do I stop? Uh, okay. And so next thing you know, Avila, she pops up and she's like, oh no, baby, you need to run because you don't want none of this. And he ends up also running into Donna Anna and she realizes in that moment that, oh my God, he's the person who assaulted me and killed my father, I must get him. And so she teams up with Elvira and Otavio and they go to the party. So she takes her off. Then Anna and Otavio, they come in and they're just like, hey Donji, could you help us find this murderer who killed my dad? And then Anna, all of a sudden she realizes, Wait, I know that voice. And then everybody comes and realizes Don Giovanni is a really bad guy. And they all like hear Zerlina screaming because she's being assaulted by Giovanni. And then they go and they're like, we got you. And then he like flees away. And then Don Giovanni says, oh no, I'm not the bad guy. He holds up Leporello and says, Leporello's the bad guy. Leporello says, no. Everybody says, no. And then that's the curtain. Leporello tries to leave and get a new job because his boss has tried to kill him. Well, now he's on to the next one, which happens to be Elvira's maid. So now he's decided, Leporello, we're gonna switch places. So I'm gonna let you handle Elvira while I go over here. Don Elvira is with Leporello, who she thinks is Don Giovanni. Don Giovanni is with the maid, who thinks it's Leporello. What happens? What happens? Oh, and then they end up, Leporello and Giovanni end up being in a cemetery. And then they go to the graveyard on their way out, and they are just, like, why are they in the graveyard? That's the, they, I think they just passed by the graveyard. Uh, they are walking down Central Park and Don Giovanni are like, oh my God, look at that statue, it's talking. And then it actually does talk. And he's like, well, come to my chain up. And they invite the, um, the statue of Don Anna's dad over for like dinner, cause that's what you do. They have a feast and Don Giovanni drinks. Knock, knock, who's there? Uh, commendatory, commendatory too. Give me your hand. Uh, the statue comes over and he's like, do you feel bad for anything that you did? The commendatory says, repent. He doesn't repent. Leporello says, repent. Don Jesus is like, man, I'm living my best life. He does not repent and he goes straight to hell. He sends him to hell. He dies. 